Check in now with Cleverly. Hey, Melissa, we're in the kitchen at Ragin' Cajun on Richmond with the big crawfish on the roof. I'm fascinated. Dominic, <laughs> Dominic Mandola is a partner with his father, Luke Mandola Sr. He's going to show us how to make grilled oysters and barbecue shrimp. This is the, what the finished dish looks like, everyone. It's gorgeous. So, Dom, how do we get started? All right. We got our grilled oysters right here. We shuck our oysters. Okay. Can you show us how you shuck the oyster? Oyster right here. Shuck okay. an oyster. Don't wear a glove, Dom. That's dangerous, isn't uh, it? Yeah, I should be wearing gloves. <laughs> okay. Okay, we start off with Romano cheese. Put uh -huh. Romano all over yeah. the oysters. Grated Romano, very fresh Italian cheese. Uh -huh. Second, we go with shredded Parmesan. Oh, wow, okay. two cheeses. Lots of cheese. We love cheese. All Italians like cheese. Awesome. Okay. Yeah. From there, we go on to our grill. Yeah. about that is I was I thought you would put the heat on the top of the oyster. No, we go straight on the oyster, straight on with the cheese, yeah. and then we douse, we have a lemon sauce. Wow. Okay, the lemon sauce, compound butter, it's got basil, oregano, yeah. dill, and, oh, wow. That's and se seasons and lemon. Yeah. We douse them in that and this is our finished product. The flame comes in. Uh-huh. That's something that we could do at home on our own grill, Correct. right? Yes, ma'am. And you're going to give us the recipe, right? Yes, ma'am. Everyone, the recipes will be this afternoon available for you at HoustonTexasFood.com. And then, uh, Dom, let's move on to the barbecue okay. shrimp. Okay. That's it. Elliot, right there, is going to do the barbecue shrimp for you. Okay. So, Elliot, show us that. Okay. One of New Orleans' famous dishes comes from Pasquale Minetti's. It is barbecue shrimp. Yeah. We start with our 912 count shrimp. Right. Get them seared up here. We want a nice little steam finish on it. As soon as we get those going, we're going to flip back over here. Okay. We'll grab all of our ingredients and just go right to town. Okay. And you, I notice you have the heads on the shrimp. Heads and the tails on to add a whole bunch of extra flavor in there. Right. And then what did you just put in? I put in lemon juice. I put in garlic. I've got a little bit of Cajun seasoning. Yeah. We've got black pepper. Uh-huh. We finish it off with some fresh onions. Okay. Very nice. And how do you get that nice sauce? That sauce comes straight from the black Worcestershire and butter. This is what it looks like, everyone, when it's done. And so how do you get that sauce so nice and thick and with dark that like that? butter and Worcestershire sauce. Sauce. And what kind of shrimp do you like, Elliot? We like 912 Gulf Jumbo Shrimp. Okay, from the Gulf? Yes, from yes? the Gulf. Okay, and how long have you worked here? I've worked here for a year and a half now. And how Not do you like it? I'm looking back. I love it. Dominic, what's your favorite dish here? Char grilled oysters right here. Woohoo! crawfish. All right. And a fried shrimp po' oh boy. All right. Oh, I want oh, one I of like those. I like it all. Oh. I like it all. All right, Dominic, thank you so much for having us. Thank we had the very best much. time. Happy, Happy Mardi, Mardi Gras. Gras. Hey, this is Cleverly live at Raging Cajun on Richmond for Fox 26 Morning News. Let's see what Jake is up to. I know he's envious. Cleverly, tell him that place is right by my apartment, so I am on my way as soon as I'm done here.